Good morrow. I am Peridot, as she said. I would like to tell you a story I had of a very learned person, an actual doctor of literature. I would like to add some details to make it more human, because the original telling was very brief. Brief, I cannot be. There once was a man of, sadly, the lower classes. Let's say he's a weaver. As we all know, a weaver is paid by what he produces in his own cottage hovel, whatever, by the end of the week. So, when whoever's representative comes, picks up the weaving, and pays him, he starts on a new week of production. He, of course, takes off the Sabbath. They are well known for also celebrating St. Monday and St. Tuesday, leading, of course, to a lot of labor to accomplish in just a few days. This particular weaver, let's say it was the evening of St. Monday, had been to the tavern and was endeavoring to make his way home. True to his colleague, calling, he woke and turned and stumbled, rose, and continued weaving down the road. At some point, he seems to have completely lost his way, or at least his consciousness. <laughs> so he was lying by the side of the road, unfortunately with his lower body entirely onto the road. When along came, a, a most industrious man driving a wagon in the middle of the night, as he goes along, he suddenly feels a bump and a bump. And he looks and realizes he's run over the legs of, of the poor weaver. He alights from his wagon, runs over, and says, Oh, sir, I believe I have run over your legs. And the weaver looked, and he smiled and corrected him. Oh, no, those are not my legs. Moral of the story, you can lose more than you might have expected if you imbibe too heavily. 